And so in January of last year, this little three-year-old, Curtis Binkley, was put on the transplant list for a liver donor. We uh, started praying about it and everything like that, uh, sticking his face and picture in the church bulletin. And, you know, um, and then eventually one day we uh, found out that uh, there was somebody on out there. That somebody happened to be Shannon Black. She had signed up to be tested as a living liver donor, hoping to give a portion of her liver to her cousin, who also needed a transplant. Sadly, her cousin did not survive. I think if he hadn't had to wait so long, he could have maybe made it through. But in that process, guess what? It turned out Shannon's liver was the perfect size and match for little Curtis. Welcome news for a family praying for a miracle. We finally had, you know, hope after just waiting months and months and months. This is little Curtis now. After that successful liver living donor transplant, his family and Shannon met up with us at Cincinnati's Great American Ballpark. A major league game this month supports living liver donation. Without the donations, I'm, I mean, I don't know what we would be doing right now. While Shannon is sad about her own family's loss, she says every donor moves someone else up the list. And I think it's just a really important um, life-changing thing to do. The family of this now healthy little boy says you can't imagine how much. It takes an amazing person uh, with uh, to give a part of themselves so a little guy like him could live. The Living Liver Foundation's second annual Living Donor Awareness Game, where the Reds play the Brewers at Great American Ballpark, is April 11th. We have a link inside the digital version of this story if you'd like to find out about ticket information and attend and support this great mission. You can always find our local 12 stories right here on YouTube. Don't forget to tap subscribe, and then you can get all the notifications.